One more mystery to take note of about also how we're going from Daniel, and yet it's taken us to where we are right now, what we're witnessing. There's something else about this creature. And I want to draw your attention to a, a word that's almost, I've never heard it brought up, and yet it's there in Hebrew. It says, but that fourth creature was unlike all the other creatures. Unlike it stands out, unlike nothing like, well, Rome was different in many ways. You could say it was different, but there's something about this here. I'm going to share something, you know, that, that most do not see, and that is that it says this, some of your Bibles say that fourth creature was diverse from the rest. Well, first of all, look at the other creatures. The other creatures are animals. They're mixed in some ways, but they're animals. The fourth creature doesn't say any, the first one you could say, okay, a lion. Then you could say a bear. Okay, we got something. You got, you got a leopard, but the fourth creature, there's nothing. You can't see what it is. The fourth creature actually has metal in it. It has iron teeth and bronze claws. Now, now, I, metal doesn't grow. Metal isn't natural. Metal isn't biological. And nor is bronze. Metal and bronze are things that man fashions together. It's diverse. It do, it's, like, it's, like, it's almost like you know, when you see something of metal that's moving, you almost think about robots. You know, because the, I'm not saying it was a robot, but I'm saying is that they have that thing. It's, it is not primarily natural. It's unnatural. Hi, I'm Jonathan Kahn. Thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. I hope you were blessed with the video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so you're notified every time a new video is posted. Feel free to share your reactions with your comments and how you were blessed. And share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you next time.